Hello there and welcome. I'm Machine Dana. I hope you're having a really, really good day. So I've really, really struggled to find a solution that will reverse the order of the chat on Twitch. Now that is to say, instead of messages appearing downwards like this, as the new messages come in, they appear at the bottom, to make it so that new messages appear at the top, at the top, at the top all the time. And the reason why I want this is when I'm streaming, my chat monitor, which is a vertically mounted monitor, is just below my camera. So I want my eye line to be on the camera and then to be looking just below it at the most recent chats. Now, of course, you've got the vertical monitor, which means I can still see down quite a lot of chat, but I want to be able to see the most recent messages at the top. And that just keeps me focused a little bit more on chat and hopefully increases my engagement to my own stream. So I've been searching around for quite a long time. I have to say, I found it really difficult to find good solutions out there. I managed to find three different solutions, two of which I was able to successfully implement and one of which I think I did all the right things, but it didn't work. Now I'm going to show all all three methods in this video and I'll show the third method last which involves CSS changing within the website. The reason why I'm still going to show that third method even though I couldn't get it to work there might be some people out there that can get it to work and I'm really hoping that someone will comment below how they were able to get that third method to work. However the first two methods do work they bring different things to the table which is why I'm not just giving one solution here you may have a particular preference on what you want this to look like it's really the look and feel and how it operates that makes the difference here. So yeah, I've not really seen many videos about this. In fact, I couldn't really find any videos about this. So I thought I'd do three different methods. Hopefully you find it useful. Hopefully it really, really helps you and your chat. If you find it useful, please do hit the like button, comment and let me know that you found it useful. Feel free to come and check me out on my stream at twitch.tv forward slash machine day. And if you want to come out and say hi, and yeah, let's go. Okay, so the first of three methods to reverse the order of your chat. I'm using Restream for this. Now, if you didn't know what Restream was, it's basically a platform that pulls together the stream keys for all of the different platforms that you may want to stream on, and it can push one stream out to multiple platforms. A lot of people use this to do multi-streaming, for example, if you want to stream on Facebook and also YouTube gaming at the same time. But of course, as part of that, what Restream has is a tool that amalgamates all of the different chats into one chat. But the really nice thing is that as part of that you can reverse the order of the chat so i'm going to very quickly show you how you can set up an account here link your twitch account to stream on it and then reverse the order of the chat so you need to go to app.restreamio.home or just type it into google and set up a account with restream you need to go to stream with studio and what will happen here is it will basically ask you to connect some destinations so if you'd like to reverse the order of your youtube chat for example or pop it out and have that in a separate window then you would connect your facebook but i'm just going to go with twitch and authorize this i would we can see here at any point you can edit destinations and connect any other destinations that you want to. Now I've just moved my camera out of the way here. On the right hand side we've got this panel. You can do different things like organize the graphics of how this looks, close captions and also chat. Now unfortunately I don't think I've been able to find within the actual stream player a way that you can reverse the order of your chat and of course there's going to be some people here that are watching this that won't want to stream through Restream. So if you're watching this and thinking well I don't want to use Restream that's fine. Remember we only really want to use this for chat and specifically to reverse the order of the chat. So don't worry too much about this. Once you've set up the account on Restream, you can just do a search for Restream Chat. Now this is an application that you can install on Windows, but we're then going to use a browser-based version of that installation. It'll all become clear in a second. So we need to download this and install it for Windows. I already have this installed, so I'm going to open Restream Chat here. Once you've installed Restream Chat, you then literally have all of the chat panels for all the different chats that you've connected to. So if you've only connected your Twitch, only your Twitch chat will be connected here. Now even in offline mode I can type test here and we can see that the message has appeared the good thing about restream is it tells you what platform the chat has come from obviously it's all going to be from twitch because I've only connected twitch but if there were people talking in different platforms here for example if you had linked facebook as well that text would appear here and you could respond to them so what we're just going to do here is click into the settings tab here and we're going to click on appearance this brings up various appearance settings so if you want to make some changes to the scale the colorized authors all kinds of other stuff like that you can do and obviously those things in themselves might enhance the chat for you. We're specifically bothered with embedding this stream and we want to look at this message alignment section here and we're going to align it to the top. Now, first of all, just to test it, I'm going to align it to bottom and as we can see, all the messages are previewing at the bottom here. But I've noticed that it doesn't always work in the chat panel here. So what I'm going to do is copy the web browser version of this. I'm going to open a new tab here, paste this in. Now, of course, if we type some test chats here. Goose, test it's opening on the bottom. But if we now go to this alignment and align to top, we'll just refresh the browser, test, 
Testing. Goose. And there you go. So you can just now full size this if you want to, if you've got a dedicated monitor or resize it and position this wherever you want. But the text is positioned at the very top. That is method one in its entirety. Just bear in mind that this application does need to be installed. And this is how you would access it every time by embedding the stream. But you could probably bookmark this link for an easy access to it. Final note on this as well. I have actually closed down the restream chat app and the browser based version of it is still working perfectly. The second method is probably my favorite method because it natively uses the same Twitch chat and it doesn't use a new user experience like what Restream chat does. However, there are actually some options that are not as good as the options in Restream. For example, you can't connect multiple chats to it. So a lot of people probably already use better TTV for emotes and things like that. So if you're already using it, great. But a lot of people don't know that you can use better TTV to reverse the order of the chat and then pop out the chat panel and use that in your rig. So I've already downloaded and installed better TTV, but basically it's a Chrome browser that you can install on Chrome. Just to check that better TTV is actually enabled as an extension once you've installed it to your browser, you can type in chrome dot dot forward slash forward slash extensions, or you can find it within the options. And you just want to make sure that better TTV is actually enabled here. You can also click on details or remove it. You just want to make sure that this is connected to Twitch by allowing it to work on twitch.tv like this, but it should do that by default. You shouldn't see any changes with that. And you may want to allow it in incognito if you do use incognito mode. And once you've installed this, just visit your Twitch homepage and go into the chat section of your page by clicking on chat here. It'll pop out the chat panel on the right and we can go to the cog in the bottom right hand corner here. You may just need to refresh the browser to make sure that Chrome can recognize that it's had a new extension installed. And there's some options here that are included now within Twitch, which is called Better TTV. Again, different stuff you can do with Better TTV. And just by having this, you enable loads of different emotes and loads of other benefits of Better TTV on your channel. But I'm just going to go into Better TTV settings here. And if we scroll down on the chat settings here, there's some settings that we can look at. And there's one here that says review reverse chat direction. Now, just need to bear in mind at this point, the difference between doing it on twitch.tv or doing it on your stream manager. So I've noticed that I've applied this setting on stream manager, but I've not applied it to my base normal Twitch. So that means when I'm watching other people, it doesn't affect the chat. The chat will still come to the bottom here because I've not toggled reverse chat direction on within the browser here. However, when I go into my chat on my stream manager and I follow the exact same process, so go to the toggle settings, scroll down to better TTV, click on the settings. You can see I've reversed chat direction and I've toggled this on here. Why is that important? Well, that means that I can within my chat, click this button here and pop out the chat and I can then move this particular stream manager version of my chat and resize it full size on my side screen, my dedicated chat monitor. Or let's just type goose in cap. As you can see, the chat messages appeared at the top of the chat there. Now, I said I'd go through a third method, one that I've not been able to get to work. So it's up to you guys whether you try this method, but I really wanted to show it just because some people might be more clever than me be able to get this working. But also, it just might be a more preferable option for people if you are then able to get it working. I'm going to show roughly how this works and why I'm not able to get this working. I found a thread here on Reddit, and it's to allow top-to-bottom Twitch chat using CSS. Now, this user, JalBP, he talks about being able to have like a CSS code paste bin here, which would just open in a new tab and then an example of what it looks like. And it shows it basically reversing the order of chat. Here's the CSS code. It's really not a lot of code to work with. It's like 18 lines of code. And what he uses here is a Chrome extension called Stylebot to use a custom style script specifically for, and he uses it for Firefox. There's also a GitHub here if people want to read up a little bit more about it. So you can see on my extensions, I've installed Stylebot here here and click on the buttons and go on to style button look at options this opens up some context and we can then do some styles here and so on what i did was to add a new style and i added it to my dashboard url and i went to edit this and i pasted in this paste bin code then i click save on that and i think what's supposed to happen is whenever this page is enabled the css can restyle certain elements and on the basics tab you can click to enable it or disable it and you can also have like some toggles to toggle it on and off so here, when I right click and go on Stylebot to style element, it pops out this new window here. Again, because I've set this up 
to, to work on my dashboard URL, the code that I set up earlier does now appear. I can see that within this panel, I've got like basic code and then magic. I'm not sure what these exactly do, but under the code section here, that's where that code has been pasted. And it's kind of here that I start to get a little bit stuck with it, to be honest. For, for some reason, this just doesn't seem to work. If you're watching this and you even know the designer of this bot or you can figure it out for yourself, please feel free to leave in the comments how to get this working. So there you go, three methods, albeit one of them I couldn't get to work properly for being able to reverse the order of your chat on stream so you can get the newest messages at the top. Hopefully you did find it useful. Hit the like if you did. Subscribe if you did or not. I don't really care, but whatever you do, have a great day.